Hey, my 3SK family. Someone once said, what is meant for you will not pass you by. Stay tuned for today's video. Hello, y'all. Hello, hello, hello. Well, I made it to Wilmington. Um, this is probably the only city I'm going to ever do Uber Eats in. Unless I actually move elsewhere. It's the closest one. About 35 minutes, 40 minutes. Um, so yeah, but I am about to log in, take my picture, and then take another picture, taking the pictures for verification, and then another picture to show that I'm going to be wearing a mask and all that good stuff, and I will get back with y'all. gonna hit go and I'm online all right let me take this off I don't have to put the mask back on until I actually go to okay so I'm online and let's see if I can find some trips so this shows like this is an example of the hot spots and red and that's towards the mall. I know where that area is. So I'm going to start driving ahead over there. Alrighty, let's head over there. Okay, y'all. Here is an order McDonald's, South College Road. I don't know if I'm going to take that. I think it's going to take me a minute to get there. So I don't know if I'm going to take that. Let me explain why I didn't take that one. Yes, that was my first one, but I didn't take it because I'm probably about 20 minutes away from Mac that McDonald's. And total, I the total trip, they didn't want me to go over like 25 minutes. So that would not have worked. So I'm glad I did not just jump on it. Had I been um, maybe about 10 minutes closer, I would have. But it's going to take me a while just to even get to that restaurant. So I did not take it. Hopefully, I'll take the next one, though. Over the bridge we go. I do not like bridges, y'all. I really don't. So um, it's reading that... Um, I'm in a busy area and I can expect trips soon. So I'm gonna kind of pull over here to the mall, I think. Yeah. And I'll just kind of wait it out. All right, so I'm waiting here at the mall. Um, wouldn't that be funny if Asia shows up? I know she has parked at the mall before in kind of in transition. So that would be pretty funny if she showed up and waited here. Okay, so I have gotten a little bit closer to what is called the hot zone. Um, I'm over here near UNC Wilmington. Hopefully, I'll get another buzz now. I have not updated you in a minute. Um, I missed out on two trips, y'all. I'm feeling kind of salty over that, but I knew that my timing was going to be really bad um, had I taken those because of the area I was in at the time. So, we're just going to wait it out and see what happens. And um, I'm definitely taking the next one. Definitely taking the next one. Okay, y'all, I got my first um, trip, Bojangles, and I'm right here at it. Wish me luck. Okay, so I have to pick up in the store. I'll see you in a minute. Y'all, that was my first order, my first trip, and I had to cancel it because the Bojangles closed unexpectedly. I don't know if that's relative to COVID or what, but they had to close. So I canceled the customer's order. I messaged them, and I called them, and he was fine. Okay, so. so hopefully this order works out better than the first one. I had to cancel the first one. Um, this is for Matthew, and it's at Chipotle. 
I'm picking it up in the store. Okay, so hopefully this order works out better than the first one. I have to cancel the first one. Um, this is for Matthew, and it's at Chipotle. And I'm and picking it up in the store. And it gives me the directions, instructions. Using the left lane, make a left turn on South College Road. All right, I am headed to Chipotle. Hopefully this one won't be canceled. Hopefully they will not be closing down unexpectedly. Got my hand sanitizer already. And I'm going to soon be putting on my mask. Using the right lane, make a right turn on Oleander Drive. Go ahead and be doing this. y'all so I just wanted to talk to you a little bit <sighs> I've been online for two hours but I've only done two trips my the green backs aren't looking too good y'all I've been hustling now I will say I have turned down probably five or six trips so you know it is what it is now Asia my daughter my youngest daughter she would not have turned down some of those trips or her numbers would be much higher um and i've got to get my delivery time up i've got to get my timing a little bit better so i'm gonna work on that tuesday when i come back um or whatever day i come back next week so yeah i just thought i would just tell you that you know i'm gonna go in dollar tree get me a mr good bar use the bathroom and head back on and this is probably a good place to wait to um, starting at 5 that's when it gets the hot spot going again so we'll see we'll see how it goes okay hey y'all um, I was a bit discouraged when I first looked at the amount that I had made but it turns out one of my customers actually tipped me and y'all I'm not gonna tell you how much over I was as far as timing and getting there <sighs> so I'm feeling pretty good right now I'm about to eat me some wings if you don't have a wings nearby I'll eat enough for me and you both but if you have a wings nearby go and get you some all right let me hit this wings and then I'm gonna try to do a few more trips alrighty about to dive in y'all and here's my little basket um, I think I'm going to put it in the back because it leans in the front but here's my little basket I just take the package of my orders and just put it in there you know that kind of holds it and keeps it neat okay I just wanted you all to get a glimpse at my food not bad huh and they do allow you uh, I have I was I ordered a six piece but they do allow you, and I didn't even know it, but they do allow you to get like half and half. So, and my lighting is bad. But I was able to get the lemon pepper and the barbecue. So, I did three and three. And I'm not happy with my fries necessarily. I like mine less crispy. Well, they just, I guess they just look crispy. Because I think they're about to be good. I didn't oh, have yeah. wings. Which, I don't live in a town. Technically, where I live is known as a village on the map, for real. But if I lived, like, here in Wilmington, and there wasn't a wing, and I knew about I a wing, wing but it would be on by. I didn't want to sit in, you know, of course, North Carolina. We've been one of the slowest states 
if not the slowest, in reopening. And so we're stuck in phase two right now. I'm looking to go back to phase one any day now. But anyway, um, I didn't want to sit in. It's a very clean place, Our the location here. Very clean wings. But I just couldn't do it, y'all. I just couldn't do it. I've done that once since North Carolina opened back up or reopened on their dining. Um, and that was only because my husband and I went out for our anniversary. That was at Ruby Tuesday's. Uh, all right, well, let me eat some more. And y'all, while I'm talking, um, eating and talking, let me put it out here. No one truly wants to wear a mask, right? I don't care how cute they are or whatnot. Nobody really wants to wear them. But because you could somehow, any of us at any given point, could somehow get COVID, you got to put it on, y'all. I'm just saying, you just put on the mask. Like, this dude just walked in the Dollar Tree. And he grabbed a half of a t-shirt, it looked like he'd cut it. Put it on, wrapped it around his mouth and nose, tied it around his neck, tied it in the back of his neck, kept going. Whatever it takes, what? Right? Get your little face covering that works and put it on. You know? Alright, just yeah, thought I'd put it on. Make their own ranch. I meant to show you that. So, yeah, it's bomb, y'all. Oh, and yes, they do make their own ranch. I meant to show you that. So, yeah, it's bomb, y'all. Okay, y'all, this is about to be my third trip. So, I'm heading. I think I'll be getting a pickup from Panda Express. So, hold on, y'all. It's 426. I want to work until about 6, 630, so I can be in this hot times. Hot time being five. Make a right turn on Sigmund Road. All right, right turn. I'm sort of getting used to it. There, there's some areas that I don't know in Wilmington, but I can, in a quarter mile, I make a left turn on Van Campen Boulevard. I can definitely connect because I know the main road. So if you know the main roads, you should be able to do the streets and avenues if you know you should be able to make a left turn on Van Campen Boulevard then pick up Panda Express right here oh that didn't take very long I'm glad I chose this one y'all it didn't take long at all wow Not long at all. Yep, I'm almost right here, pretty much. Using the right lane, keep right toward US, Highway 117 South. I got off track. I got way off track. How in the world did I do this? How did I get so way off track? In a quarter mile, make a right turn on Jeff Gordon Drive. Oh man, I just wasted some of my time. I just realized what I did. That happens though, you know? That definitely happens, but luckily I'm right here, so it's not make too a right turn on Jeff Gordon Drive. Now it's going to take me back around. Y'all, I'm whipping this car today. I'm trying to tell you. Make a right turn on Van Campen Boulevard. Okay, I'm back on the same road where I should have been already. But it's okay. It's just fun. Okay, I'm about to pull up. Not gonna miss it this time, y'all. I'm right here at it, and I'm not missing it this time. You better believe it. There's no way I'm missing it this time. Pick up. 
Da da! This time I did not miss it. Okay, I'm right here, y'all. I don't know if I can go in or what. I guess I should have been paying attention to it. Alright. Okay, let me. Okay, as you can see, it's a pretty nice order. Definitely dinner. Okay, Definitely the supply dinner. company is going to bring it out to me. So, I guess they're not really updating the system. You can't go in the restaurant. So, they're bringing it out, and I don't mind. Y'all, these are definitely some parts of Wilmington I've never gone to. I don't mean in a bad way, by any means. And I mean, really, really nice parts of Wilmington. Um, yeah, very nice. Okay, so this is definitely parts of Wilmington I've never been to. Beautiful golf course out here. Clue is on this part of Wilmington. Not to say the other parts of Wilmington aren't nice, but I've had some breaks here and there. Um, I'm about to do my seventh trip. Um, this is my second time coming back to Outback. So probably once I do this one, I'm gonna just finish off and get a little gas and head on out of here. Oh, it's, by the way, it's 721, it's my seventh trip. So I'll check. I haven't been online, of course, the whole time, but with this seventh trip, it should be that I'll clear like right at $85, 80, yeah, right at $85. So that's not too bad, especially considering I don't know the, the back roads all that well. So yeah, I'm a little bit tired. But God is still good, y'all. And this right here is making me want to do, just follow my dreams. Like a lot of the little things that I thought I couldn't do, or the big things even, just want to follow my dreams, y'all. And I can see that coming one day. I can see. See my retirement. I can see my retirement coming one day, and I can see that house coming one day. And if not a house, um, our total remodeled home, um, mobile home that we're in, and maybe me and she shit out back. We'll see. Alrighty, just checking in. Sitting here at Outback, there's several. Made it home, y'all. I did eight trips, mostly short because I wasn't there during most of the hot spot times. But I'm feeling pretty good about Uber Eats, and who knows, it might be something I can do. I'm getting ready to exercise. My son is waiting on me. He's on me about it. Talk to y'all another time.